appears that the head of FIFA, the governing body of global soccer, Gianni Infantino, is very upset as the 2022 Men's World Cup tournament is ready to get underway. The Qatar World Cup has caused a lot of problems because the country's stadiums were built by what critics have called slave labor. Then the country decided that beer should not be sold to common fans at the stadiums holding the games, but the high rollers and the expensive hospitality suites will be able to get alcohol. Infantino seemingly is sick of human rights activists complaining about who built the stadiums and vented his frustrations. Today, I have strong feelings. Today, I feel Qatari. I feel Arab. I feel African. I feel gay. I feel disabled. I feel a migrant worker. Of course, I'm not a Qatari. I am not an Arab. I am not African. I am not gay. I am not disabled. But I feel like it because I know what it means to be discriminated, to be bullied as a foreigner in a foreign country. As a child, I was bullied because I had red hair and freckles. Plus, I was Italian. So imagine, I went in my room and I cried. I feel for the FIFA and Supreme Committee staff. They want to deliver here. I am proud to have this FIFA sign on my jacket. It will be the best World Cup ever. Qatar is ready. Infantino then unloaded on Europeans for what we Europeans have been doing around the world in the last 3,000 years. We should be apologizing for the next 3,000 years before starting to give moral lessons to people. Qatar is a land of opportunity for workers who built the stadiums, according to Infantino. Welcome to Infantino's 2022 Men's World Cup. I'm Evan Wiener.